landmark for this generation, the Lord Jehovah in that dream, he lifted me to a place and then I saw the ancient of days and he commanded me to strike the earth with my left prophetic hand. And when I did as I was commanded, then I saw a very shocking plague that struck the earth. And that plague that struck the earth came all over people's bodies. Right now I see boils. It will be an infectious disease that is coming based on the words of my tongue today. An infectious disease, very contagious, very, very infectious. A dreadful disease is coming upon the face of the earth. And that disease is characterized by lots of boils, 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 big boils that are huge and they are reddish in color. And each of the boils has an eye. And the eye of the boil is a bit dark. And then those boils burst. They burst and the fluid flows out. And that fluid is very infectious. When it flows out, the Lord has shown me that the fluid infects the uninfected parts of the body. And there are smaller, smaller, little reddish, painful boils that begin to develop. Very painful. And when the boils come on the surface of the skin of human beings, then it's so painful that they cannot even bathe. Cold water cannot touch you. And when they lie on the bed, as they get up, their skin remains on the bed. This is a prophecy I'm giving now that the Lord has commanded me to strike the earth, again, all the nations of the earth, with a disease that is worse than the coronavirus that I spoke way back in 2015, that has threatened to shut down the whole earth and you know, in that prophecy of 2015, I say it now strictly based on the words of my time, I strike the earth with a disease, with a plague, to mark the times of the beginning of birth pain, that the nations of the earth may know that the coming of the Messiah has drawn nearer. That the messenger that was promised in the book of Malachi, Malachi chapter 3, verse 1 to 2 on, Malachi chapter 4, that that messenger is now here. When he said, remember the law of my servant Moses. And in those days, I will send you Elijah the prophet. And now, strictly based on the words of my tongue, another disease is coming to the earth, but this one, this time around, has boils, 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 all over the, the skin of men and women. It is such a dreadful disease, and the Lord has taken ash and dust, placed on my hand, and I tossed it towards the Lord of hosts. And when the dust came back on the soil and it formed, it, it was not smooth. It's little molds, little molds. I even see them. This is a dreadful time in the history of the earth. And why is the Lord doing this to the people living on the earth? Men have been so comfortable on this earth. There has been a lot of complacency in the life they live on the earth. They live in comfortable homes. They eat comfortable foods. They live in the comfort of their families. The technology of the day, the postmodernism, has caused complacency in men to the extent that they have rejected Christ. 
And now the Lord is making life on the earth very unbearable, uncomfortable, that they may now seek God, that they may know that the Lord is destroying the earth, destroying the comfort of the earth, that they may turn to Jesus, that their comfort may be rubbished to fatality, that they may seek exit out of this earth. Look at the coronavirus that I struck on the earth. I struck the nations with. Flights cannot go to China. And in that prophecy I said it will be in Asia. Five years away. 2015. Look now what has happened there. Look what's happening globally. Look at the dread. But today now. On this 26th day. Of February. The year 2020. Strictly based on the authority of the words of my tongue. I have stood before the ancient of days. And now I strike the earth with another plague. And that plague will be characterized by boils, boils, a lot of boils on the surface of the skin of men and women. All people that will touch that infection, it will be contagious with a contagion. And there will be the dread and the terror of death. This is the fullness of time. For the beginnings of our pain that you see written in scripture that Jesus talked about in the book of Matthew 24. When he said perilous times would consume on the earth. There would be a consummation of perilous times upon the surface of the earth. The face of the earth before the coming of the Messiah. And the Lord is saying that he's calling upon all the nations, all men, to come to the knowledge of Christ, to repent and turn away from sexual sin, lies, sexual lust between men and women, men and men, women and women, homosexuality. There is so much sexual sin on the earth. The love of money. They have forgotten the Messiah and the price he paid at Calvary. The Messiah is coming. This is the voice of one calling out the wilderness. I have seen the Messiah coming. Calling out in the, out in the wilderness of the earth. Come out and repent. Make your ways right with God. Amend your ways. The kingdom of God is near. The king is coming. The Messiah is coming. He died on the cross. He shed his blood for you. You can't ignore him. Time is over. The message of the kingdom is here. He is calling the nations to repentance. To receive Christ. Believe the gospel. The Messiah is coming. My Lord is coming. Now look. Based on my words today. There is a tremendous plague. Worse than the coronavirus you see in Asia. The Lord has commanded me to strike the earth. And have struck the earth. So there will be a lot of boils. Painful boils. And those boils they are round. And they become ripe. Full of fluid. And they have an eye. A dark eye which bursts. And shrinks and collapses. And then the fluid that comes out. Is a contagion. Contagious. Infects the other parts of the body. Now you see the small reddish boils. Small ones also growing. It's unbelievable pain. Horrendous pain, unbearable pain coming to the earth. The Messiah is coming. Book of Revelation. You've not assembled to them 